we will learn about what is known as motion twin so we will learn about twinning and in fact i am bringing you first towards animation so that you don't get bored okay in many tutorials i saw that okay they are telling about drawing and so on but when people start to understand animation they would like to first go bang into animating something so let's start with tweening and then we will go to make some better cartoons and so on so tweening and classic animation okay so these are the two things so we will go with motion tweening so there are objects okay symbols so you can only move what are known as symbols so first you make some drawing okay then you create convert it into symbol and then you can move it okay so let's start we will what we will do is we will have a circle we will draw a circle which will move first here to this side and then it will move to this side and then we will see how we do okay and here again to remind you this is the timeline this a needle player play moves here and it sh runs just the frames it shows you the frames and it shows 24 frames per second okay which you can change also but now it says it's 24 frames per second and 24 pictures it will show you in one second okay so let's try to start let's start basically so we will remove this one and from here I will draw a circle okay so you can take this draw a circle here okay this is a circle and then as I told you you need to convert it into a symbol so I will convert it into a symbol we will look at it in detail what is a symbol but for making animation you need to convert your drawing to a symbol ball okay so ball my ball is here right now now i want it to move so first i said i want to move it here then return back so first second let's say in first 25 frames so insert keyframe it means okay so there's twin is already there so it means this is the first second it's here and final position i have to tell so i tell it that okay finally you move till here but this is not showing a proper way for drawing okay so i will remove this tween and create another layer okay so don't bother about all this just see this one okay i remove it and this is my i'm drawing now so i had created a symbol which is here so this is a ball and then what i want to do i will say that okay create motion tween so now what happens for first second it created a motion tween now in the end of 24th second frame i want the ball to be here so ball has gone and this is the motion path that is being showed by this dot dot lines and in fact it's showing that okay in the first frame it's here second second frame it's here third frame here fourth fifth sixth 7th frame it's here, 8th frame it's here and so on. In the 24th frame it's here basically. So this is you can see from the drawing also I'm at the 10th frame I'm here, 15th frame I'm here, 28th frame I'm here and the final frame I'm here. Okay. So this is done. Now for the first second the motion is there. I run it here. This is the timeline and the ball is moving fine. Now I have to move it again to the for the next second okay so now insert keyframe it says for so we will have option for position scale skew rotation and all so position means i want to move it where the position scale means become large smaller skewness it becomes some skewed the shape is skewed deformed something like that it changes the shape rotation it's rotating okay so i will give a position okay so this ball should now move again 
to its original place okay so now let's try to see the ball moves here ball moves there okay so this is your bang on animations okay where i moved a ball right then i moved it to the left and there was nothing just to recap i created i created a ball okay so i will just recap it for you so what i did i uh, created a ball okay and then i converted it into a symbol because animation for animation you need to convert your drawing to a symbol call it ball then you create a motion tween first second it's done i want my ball to be in the end so in the 25th sec frame it's here then in the 50th frame around i again say insert keyframe position and again move it here so you play it it moves there and okay then it didn't come back what happened okay so in the 25th frame it should have been here okay it's there now now it's not okay it's i keep it here now so now you can see it's moving and then it's moving so this is where you have to decide insert keyframe okay so that's how you can do or 